Okay, thank you for getting these uh, cameras installed. They're working great, so everything's looking good, ham. So you did a wonderful job getting the cams working, but now you've got those two holes <laughs> in the wall. Miss Summer King is uh, cutting the hole to pull the cable through for the uh, camera that we will be waiting for the uh, postman to deliver. He got it on the truck, but he hadn't brought it yet. So she's cutting the hole out. She's doing a good job. But once she gets that hole out, then we'll cut a hole, drill a hole through the basement, up through the wall, and pull the. Uh, the cable up through there for the Ethernet cable for the camera. So she get everything done now. Okay, we already got one camera mounted. She's got one done already. Show them the wires that you got. Okay, she yeah, she pulled uh, one in and got it all terminated. Now we're just waiting for a coupler to put that one on. So there's no hole at the bottom. So only the hole at the top. And when we get done, we'll replace that. Uh, plug that she's cutting out. We'll replace the plug, put a little uh, spackling on it. Uh, when it dries, we'll prime it and put some touch-up paint and you'll never know that there was anything cut in that wall. So that's what she's got. Okay, so that's the one that she's already got mounted. So she's cutting the hole now for the other one that'll go on the other side of the house. Okay, she's got the uh, string tied onto the fish pole, the fishing pole that we fished through the ceiling. Show, show them what you got. Okay, if you can see the fishing pole. Yep, there it is. Alright, now we're going to put some tape on it then we'll pull it back down into the basement. Okay, she's got the string tied onto the fishing pole. Now she's pulling it down. Boom. Okay, now she's got the string down. Now what we we'll do is go ahead and hook the uh, uh, the Ethernet cable on the string, pull it back up. Got the wire tied onto the uh, Ethernet cable. Now we're going to go upstairs, or I will go upstairs and pull the wire while she feeds it through. Okay, she got the wire pulled. Now she's cutting it to length. Now she's going to put the connector on it. Now my eyesight is too bad, so it does not, uh, I cannot do it. So she's going to go ahead and put the connector on it. Now she's doing the uh, technician part of it. She remembered to put the cover on it. Sure is nice to have a granddaughter that can do all this uh, technical work. I put her up on the ladder. I put her up in the attic. She's going to have a journeyman's card. Since I was a journeyman electrician, I guess she's my apprentice. So maybe after four years apprenticeship with me, she can get her journeyman card. Alright. She's putting the little tiny wires and the little tiny holes, which I can't see, so she's the one that's going to do it. So once she gets them all put in, we'll put the connector on it, and I'm still waiting for the postman to deliver the camera. So as soon as he gets here, we'll mount the camera. She's up on the ladder. One, two, three. She's up on three steps up on the ladder. Okay, perfect. We just tested them and it is perfect. Almost 6 p.m. and the U Fed, uh, UPS post office just dropped it off. So before I hang it up, I got everything ready to install it on the outside, but 
I got to hook it up inside here, test it, make sure everything's working okay. So, are you excited that you got it? So excited. You can't wait to hook it up now, can you? Nope. I can see the excitement. <laughs> All right. So we got our camera. We'll probably hang it up tomorrow. So we're going to hook it up today and make sure everything's working okay. That's it. Okay, thank you for getting my cameras uh, installed. They're working great now. So now the only thing left, what are you going to do about them holes that you put in my wall over here? Patch them. Patch them. Okay. So well, let's go over here and see what we got. How are you going to repair those holes that you put in my wall to run that cable? So the first thing I did was put the drywall screw through the paint stick and then through the um, drywall sheet. And then now I'm going to apply joint compound all across um, the drywall sheet. And then across the drywall itself. drywall all across this just so it sticks good okay and then the ethernet cables are in here so we can just put the drywall back on okay I'm gonna get the corners And now we will put the drywall back in. And then smack it back in. <laughs> and that's all. Okay, so now I'm going to put the screw in the hole. Just like this. And then for the other side, we'll do the same thing. So when it dries, we'll pull, pull the board off and then we'll sand it and it'll be finished. Okay, just make sure that the plug is gently flush. I'm going to gently tap it. Once it dries, we have to pull the sticks off, sand it, and then it will be all finished. Since Miss Summer will not be here for a couple days to finish up her project, I hope she doesn't mind that I took the liberty of going ahead and removing her uh, uh, sticks that she had to secure it. And so I went ahead and put on some joint compound uh, a couple times, sanded it, and uh, used wet sand, and uh, put some primer on it. So. I'll go ahead and wait till she gets here in another day or two and then she can go ahead and touch it up with the paint. So that's it.